Well, here's a reminder for you. Taxes are due on April 18th this year rather than the normal 15th. But no matter what day they're due, there are still things you can do this month and next that can save you money on your taxes. Let's find out what they are from Alan Kiefer. Alan, thank you so much for joining us. Hey, Alex, happy tax season. Yes, indeed. And some people are fearful of it, but they really shouldn't be. What's really the first thing that we should do when we dive into it? I tell people max out your IRA, your 401k, and your other tax-referred retirement here on the bottom of the 1040, every dollar contributed is one less dollar in taxable income. And Alex, you can use $2,017 right up until April 18th. No kidding. Huge. Well, this is, I like what you're doing here because you're making taxes exciting for people where otherwise they might dread it. Oh, taxes can be fun, especially when you pay less. Well, there you go. And also people, you know, there's something called deductions, which they may not 100% know how to use or may not know how to handle. So tell us about those and what people should be really thinking about when it comes to them. Well, I say, put your assumptions away. Look at this tax, Schedule A tax deductions uh -huh. form each and every year. And as I go down, watch how much fun it can be. For example, do you have medical deductions, dental expenses, eye doctor? From last year, I do. Tax deductible. Oh. Oh my gosh, let's move on. Do you pay state income tax, I... property taxes? Hello, tax deductible. Okay. Moving on. Do you have a mortgage and pay interest? Do you have a mortgage insurance policy and pay premiums? Tax deductible. Huh. In, it's uncanny, isn't it? It is uncanny. There's more. This one you'll love. Do you have a grooming standard or dress code you have to maintain to go on live uh, camera every day? Yes, I do. Well, tax deductible <laughs> if it's not reimbursed. Okay. Now, if at your place of employment you have required work clothes or a uniform and you have to have them serviced or dry cleaned every day, tax deductible. How about you deal blackjack at the local casino, your hands are in constant public view, and you have to get them manicured? Tax deductible. Or for the ladies, you're a professional dancer and you have to get your legs waxed regularly for your performances. Yes, again, tax deductible. Hundreds of these, Alex, leading to thousands of dollars in tax deductions. Well, and the point is that people just don't know that these things exist and that they're able to actually get money back from them. That's true. And in fact, what's even more important, folks tend to focus on the cost of getting their tax return prepared. That's not the goal. The goal is who's gonna help you pay the least. Right. Did you know that in 1935, the US Supreme Court said, the legal right of the taxpayer to decrease the amount of what otherwise would be his or her taxes or altogether avoid them by means which the law permits cannot be doubted. Holy cow, it's been legal for over 82 years to avoid taxes. Unbelievable. Well, you know, what you mentioned, what I liked is some people are really sort of not clear on what counts as a deduction, what doesn't. For example, I was talking with one of my coworkers the other day, and we were saying, do our clothes really count? And as you say, if they reimburse you, then you can't you can't deduct Quite them. right. If they're unreimbursed expenses, they're countable. Okay, very good. It's, good. It's incredible, is it not? It is incredible, and all these things that we didn't know, and you said that you, you want to get your tax prepared by somebody who's going to make you pay the least. Exactly. Whether you do it yourself with TurboTax, you've got to do the research. Or if you go to AARP, your membership allows it to get done for free. Or H&R Block, Jackson Hewitt, Liberty Tax Service. Or you can use a CPA or enrolled agent or other paid tax professional. It's not the cost. It's going to, who's going to help you pay the least legally? Who wouldn't want to know? It's their patriotic duty and constitutional right to pay less in taxes. Well, the point is there's tons of options and you're never stuck with just one tax preparer. If you see that there's less of a price to do it at another one, you can go there. Any last uh, tax tips that you want to leave us with? One last one for the moment. It's not what you make that counts. It's what you keep. There you go. Good advice from Alan. You know, we learned about deductions today. We learned about who we should prepare our taxes with. You really came on and, and energized us about taxes. People dread it this time of year. Taxes can be fun, they especially be fun. when you pay less. Right. They can be fun. You don't have to dread them. And as always, thank you for coming on and uh, telling us all about it. And it, it was a pleasure. And informing us. Absolutely. Now, guys, to learn even more about saving money on your taxes, you can call 1-800-891-8797 or you can visit Alan Kiefer dot com.